Hey, players. So 23-year-old Jamia Harris was killed early Sunday morning, and police have charged a University of Alabama basketball player with her death. Yesterday, officers arrested Darius Miles, who is a University of Alabama basketball player, and charged him with capital murder, along with Michael Davis, who is also being charged with capital murder. So according to reports on Sunday at 1.45 a.m., Tuscaloosa police and the University of Alabama police were dispatched to the Walk of Champions at Bryant-Denny Stadium about a shooting. A vehicle was spotted on the side of the road, and when officers approached the vehicle, the driver told police their vehicle had been struck by gunfire. The driver said he had returned fire in self-defense and may have struck the suspect. The driver has not been identified. Unfortunately, Jamia had been struck by gunfire, and she was transported to the hospital where she later passed away. Investigators determined that the shooting occurred at the 400 block of Gray Street off of University Boulevard. They also said after speaking with multiple witnesses and viewing video surveillance, they identified two suspects. Both were located and interviewed. One suspect was found to have been struck by gunfire, but the wound was non-life-threatening. He was arrested and charged with capital murder. After questioning, Darius Miles, who was the University of Alabama basketball player, was taken into custody and also charged with capital murder. Where? Where you more than you that was Darius Miles being taken into custody. Um, I guess he was speaking to some loved ones saying he loved them more than they could ever imagine. Officials have stated that they don't have a clear motive at this time, but it appears that the shooting was a result of a minor argument that occurred between the victims and the suspects after they encountered each other along the strip. Now this morning, Darius Miles' legal team issued a statement saying that Darius and his family are heartbroken tonight over the death of Jamia Harris. While Darius has been accused of being involved with this tragedy, he maintains his innocence and looks forward to his day in court. Now, Jamia Harris was only 23 years old. She had a five-year-old son named Kane Cotton. Um, they stated that she was just trying to enjoy her weekend with her cousin that attends University of Alabama and her boyfriend. They also added that she was a loving person and she had a wonderful spirit. Of course, here at the Blackyard News, we're sending our condolences and love out to the family. This is Double D Mobile for the Blackyard News, where I'm black and the news is always petty but accurate.